Hello family, welcome back to my channel. This is Anthony and I'm here with a pretty large Dollar Tree haul. Uh, this is probably combined from three different times that I went to Dollar Tree because I really wasn't finding much. But then after a while I started looking as I was setting the bags aside till I thought I had enough. I'm like, I think I better do this haul because you know, that little bit here, little bit there was adding up. So it's pretty long so let's just get right into it but first i want to say uh welcome to my new subscribers thank you so much for joining the family glad to have you here so first i'll just start off with these two new items uh these are the pure silk body wash and these are the coconut and oat flour and i don't know if you remember uh, not too long ago they got in the pure silk shaving cream that was the same scent coconut and oat flour so I grabbed I actually grabbed four of these so I'm going to give those a try these are a 14 fluid ounce container and they do smell really strong scent of coconut and I love the coconut scent I hope that's not too much of a glare we're right by the window trying to get more light and then the other two new ones were the uh, Barbasol and Dollar Tree also carries the shaving cream the Barbasol shaving cream for men and this is the original and it is uh, also a 14 ounce so pick these up so my husband can give those a try a couple other body washes that I picked up I picked up this daily defense and it is also in coconut it's um, tropical coconut uh, aloe extract and this is an 18 fluid ounce so you get 20 percent more so I thought I'd give that one a try. Let me see if this one smells strong coconut. Yeah, this one smells very coconutty as well. Then I also picked up the Silkiance Body Care Creamy, Rich and Creamy Body Wash. And it's in the Relaxing with Vanilla, Lavender and Vanilla Scent. And it is a 24 ounce. And it's a bonus size. Um, the 24 ounce bonus size so you get 50% more and it has a nice uh, lavender scent um, let me see I smell more lavender than vanilla so I thought I'd give that one a try as well let's see a repurchase I picked up another of the Dove Intensive Cream. These are 2.53 ounces and I like to pick these up when my Dollar Tree gets them in. We haven't got the pink ones in yet but I've seen a few people haul those so just grabbed another one of those. A repurchase is this Personal Care Feminine Hygiene Spray. I love this spray. It smells really good. Picked up a couple Curad products. So I picked up the box of alcohol wipes you get 100 uh, wipes in a package and they're all individually pre-sealed prep pads these are great for a first aid kit and perfect for this time of year when the kitties are out of school and falling and everything I <laughs> uh, picked up this ouchless tape and it says sticks to itself not to skin or hair and you get one roll in the box but you know Curad is an awesome brand so I like to have those uh, I picked up some sassy and chic nails Lord knows I didn't need them but they were pretty so I will be adding them to my collection and actually I'll probably put some on today so the first ones I picked up were these black with the uh, leopard print and the leopard print one have gold a gold glitter on them really pretty I don't know can you see these 
So I got those two. I also picked up this pair that's got like a lavender and a peachy pink color. This one here I thought was really pretty. It's a really like mauve color pink. And this one, this next one is a floral print with pink, really pretty. And then this next one here is a French tip with a little silver glitter trim. Okay, what else? What else? Okay. I picked up a couple graduation items. I picked up the key ring. I do have a graduation party to go to this weekend. Uh, two of my younger cousins graduated from high school. So, um, yeah, I picked up this key keychain. Their school colors is uh, red and white. And then I also picked up the lanyard that says 2018. So one of the boys would get one of each. And then I picked up two uh, graduation cards. These are the money or gift card holders. Picked up this one. These were two for a dollar. It says Congratula congratulations grad. Look back with pride. Look ahead with confidence. Best wishes for all that lies ahead. And then the next one says uh, graduation is the start of something big a hundred paths to take a thousand ways to look at the world a million moments waiting just for you happy graduation so I got these cards so that I could put a little cash in there for them <clears throat> I picked up two of these e-circuit dual port chargers actually three of them one is already in my car I like these because it is dual and they seem to be a better quality than the uh, previous ones that I purchased. So yeah, you can charge two devices at once and they are for the car. Okay, our Dollar Tree got in some Hallmark cards. Uh, they got in the Hallmark, the Expressions Hallmark blank note cards where you get this, these two packages you get six. So these have the American flag on them. I thought these would be perfect for Happy Mail right now. So got that package. And they are just blank in the inside. And then I got this pair pack with the cute uh, shoes. I thought those were really pretty. And then this package here you get eight and it says faith is the friend that comes along when things just seem to go all wrong. And I thought these would actually go nicely into my journals, into a junk journal. So, yep, got those. I picked up these ballpoint pens and these have the American flag on them. I thought those would actually be nice for happy mail or friend mail. I can send these with a pocket letter. It says 0.8 medium black and smooth writing so hopefully they do write nice. Okay, I found some new journals. And we already know I don't need those either but they were so cute. I found this one with the llama. It says no Problemo. How cute is that? And then that's what the inside looks like. I also found this one with the cacti. And then the inside of this one is like a light green. And then I found this one with the pineapples. I love that the paper on the inside is pink and it has the little pineapples on the bottom. 
Okay, this one here is a 60 sheet notebook and it has the um, ring. It says just another, I mean just, I can't even read. Just another day in paradise. I don't know if I already read that or not. I'm losing it. And there's line paper there. Okay. These other two are by Crown Jewels. So this one here has the cactus on there. I want to see what the paper looks like. It's just line notebook paper, white. Yeah, so you get 50 sheets of paper in those. And then this other one has the flamingo. And I'm pretty sure it's just lined white paper as well. This one will be going into friend mail for sure. So I got that. And then they have some new sticky notes and list pads. But I only picked up the one package of sticky notes. You get 50. These have the unicorn on them. And I thought I can use these in the unicorn journal that I've been collecting items to make that with. Then to go along with the new journaling or journal items, they got in some new pens, some novelty pens. So they got these feather pens in and they are so cute. Look at that. They had several different prints on the feathers. So it just says printed feather pen. So I, the reason why I pick those up is I found some new photo albums and the one that I picked up has feathers on this. I'm planning on doing a DIY with this and then putting one of the pens with it. I'm going to attempt to make a journal with this. So I will come back and share if it works out. So I got that print. You get um, 24 pages that fit uh, 4 by 6 uh, pictures. But like I said, for this one for sure I plan on altering that. And then I picked up these two patterns. Which, like I say, will make nice journals. You just have to take out the picture holders and I'm thinking of you know actually just binding some paper in there I like this one it's like a boho print and I do have paper that would coordinate with that and this one here is just some pastel circles but that was my idea for those so I picked up a couple washi tapes this one with the polka dots. I'm not sure if I have that one, but I thought that was pretty, so I grabbed that. It has like pink, light blue, and navy blue polka dots. This one here, I think I do have, but I wanted to use this in my fairy journal. So it's like purple. I picked up some multi-purpose clips. These are the six pack. Dollar Tree has carried these for a long time. But this one is like a different color. I bought some over a year ago and they were more uh, primary colors. These are primary colors too, but these look a little lighter. So, got those. You can never have enough clips in the house. I picked up this package of sticky notes. Um, you get 100 sheets uh, by jot. I thought maybe I could do something with that in my crafts. I found the Crayola Mighty Marks Neon Markers. 10 washable markers. I picked up four packages of these because I thought these would go great in some little uh, craft, craft caddies. I made craft caddies one year for my craft fair. That was last year, I think. And they sold, but I was thinking of making some smaller versions, but using just Crayola products in them. 
So every time I see Crayola products at Dollar Tree, I snatch them up. So I did pick up four of those. I also picked up four boxes of the Crayola crayons. And you get 24 crayons in the box. So that's a, a good deal for some Crayola crayons. I did pick up a couple of the Crayola chalk. So they have it in white and they also have these multicolor, the variety colored pack. And you get 12 pieces of chalk in these. I found one Crayola project paint and I got this in the yellow. So if they get more in or I find some at a different Dollar Tree, I will grab them. I picked up some of the felt stickers. They had several different kinds. This pack here is the animals. And I thought this was great. You get uh, 30 stickers in six different colors. I see monkeys. I see elephants. What else you get? There's a giraffe and a lion in these. So they have the little um, sticker, the you know, little paper on the back because it is a sticker. And there's also a project on the back, a safari adventure scene. It tells you how to make that. I also picked up this one, which is the inspirational one. thought those were really cute. <laughs> I'm hoping you can see this lighting is terrible. Um, but yeah, you get 30 pieces in this one as well. I also picked up the sports themed one. This one feels kind of light. Yeah, you only get 24 in here. You get the football, the soccer ball, and the baseball. I don't know what happened to the basketball. But these would be great to uh, use in your scrapbooking layouts. And then I picked up the letters and numbers. I always need numbers and I never can find any. So you get 55 in this package. And you get five different colors. I picked up some more jaunt lab labels. These are the craft color ones. Love these. Like to use these. So I grabbed another package of those. I think that's it for the. No, not all for the crafting. I did find a couple more organizers, the jaunt organizer cases. I love to organize my craft supplies in these as well as using them for gifts for happy mail. I found a jot folder with the cacti on it. Love this. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I may cut it up. I don't know. But I thought that was cute. And I have the notebook, a couple different notebooks with the same print on it. So, yeah, had to have it. I picked up another one of these Crayola Color Alive books and it comes with the crayons. I picked up three previously for my son's wedding for the, the kiddos. Um, I was asked to put something together for them to to do at the table to keep the kids you know kind of entertaining without them running around and acting crazy. So I got the fairy books for the older girls and then I got those little um, activity packs for the younger ones with crayons and I just added some of some extra Crayola crayons into their activity pack so they had you know more colors to work with so just picked up another one of those but this one I think is for myself I want to use some of these pictures in my fairy journal also I picked up this fairies coloring book I thought that would be um, nice to use some of these pictures as well throughout a fairy journal so that is why I got those. 
Then I found this Lucky Bamboo book. Really nice book with um, nice illustrations throughout. But most likely I will end up cutting this bad boy up for um, projects or a journal. I may do a panda, a panda journal. We shall see. It's like my mind is on journals all the time now. I want to cut up every book I see. Well, we can't do that, but that's why I got that. And speaking of journals and books, I did pick up one I plan on using for sure for the journal. It's this one. It's a hardcover book called Lady Renegades. I picked this up because of the color of the book. It's purple. And I thought this would be perfect for my uh, fairy journal. And it's not too large. I could probably do one nice signature in there. So, got that. This book originally retailed for $17.99. So, I mean, if you want to read, Dollar Tree is a spot for some nice books. I picked up this one. It's uh, called The Forget Me Not Summer. I just picked this up for my girls because they love to read and I thought this would make a nice summer read for them while they're out of school. It's by Leela Howland. So we will see if they like that. This one, it says it's for ages 8 to 12 so it's perfect for them. They are 8. They will be, uh, they are not 8. What am I saying? They are 11. They will be 12 in July, so I think this will be perfect for them. I picked up this book. It's called My Journey with Maya. Tavis Smiley. Let me see. My Journey with Maya. Tavis Smiley with David Ritz. Soon to be a Broadway play. So, let me see. It says, A Passionate Depiction of a True Renaissance Woman, Washington Post. I was trying to see the year on this. Okay, this was from 2016. Well, copyright was 2015. Originally published in hardcover. April 2016. So I'm assuming that this is already a Broadway play. But anyway, I picked that up for me to read. And then I picked up this book by Whoopi Goldberg. I thought that would be fun to read. It's If Someone Says You Complete Me, Run. <laughs> Whoopi's Big Book of Relationships. And I thought this was really going to be interesting. Yeah, so I got that. I picked up some ch more chatties. So my girls have been wearing some of the ones that I already purchased. So this time of year you need something in your flat. And your feet get all sweaty. So got that. You get three in a package and these are really nice. Really good quality. I picked up those and I also grabbed two packages of socks, low cut socks for women. This is a 6 to 11. I grabbed these because I like the flamingo print and these may go in a happy happy mail. You know, I'm doing a flamingo uh, loaded bag or envelope and yeah, everything flamingo and I had originally got these for me but I don't know they may go as a gift so this pair it's two pair in the package you get the gray with the green cacti and then it has the pink pink toe and heel and then the other pair is uh, pink and two types of gray thought those were cute and why not two pair of socks for a dollar okay I picked up these pillowcases and I actually just picked them up for the material. I was thinking of making pillows with them. But now I'm thinking, when I look at this one, I'm thinking of this one for uh, a future Paris junk journal. I'm already working on one, but I'm not going to cover that one. 
but this I thought I could use this for another parish junk journal so these are 20 inches by 30 pretty a fab uh, plenty of fabric if you want to cover a book or something with them 100% um, polyester so yeah I got both in black and white let's see yeah this is a long video is it that long let me see oh um, yeah <laughs> it's long but I hope you're sticking with me because I want to just go and get all of this done okay I picked up this necklace you get three necklaces blue red and silver for the 4th of July or in uh, any of the patriotic holidays um, but I'm going to use this in my crafting okay I picked up some of these scents vent sticks in the wild berry four pack pick these up for the car we'll see how these work also picked up some sure sense Hawaiian automatic spray I like to use these um, says you can use them in your Glade Lysol and Airwick dispensers and they do work I've been using them in mine also picked up a can of the well what scent was this this is the Hawaiian and then I picked up this Glade and it is lavender and peach blossom so we'll see if we like that one I'm sorry I'm rushing but I don't want it to be an hour long so let's keep going here I picked up this jot storage container this little storage box and these were new there was a few different colors it has three drawers that swing open I'm going to put this right in my crafting area and then it has three sections up here so this section right here it's not too deep you can throw something in there and then these here the two in the back could hold some pens or pencils or a pair of scissors or a ruler so yeah this is by Jot three swing out drawers and pencil holder okay I grabbed a pack of the essentials hangers these are the eight pack they're my favorite color so I said why not got them I found these uh, energy saving floodlights in a warm white you get two in a package I just thought that was a great deal for you know these floodlights so and they are by Sunbeam so I went ahead and picked up a box of those in case we need them picked up some essentials plastic clothesline with the hook I did need more of this when the tree broke in our backyard and fell down my I lost my clothesline so yeah I was trying to see how much was on here you get 70 feet on here I picked up some wood clothespins but these are for crafting so I grabbed a pack of these you get 36 clothespins good deal I picked up one more essentials collapsible storage container actually I think I picked up three of these I've just used two of them already um, yeah these are the 10 and a half by 11 inch cubes and these work just as well as the you know the other brands I picked up this cooking concepts wire grill cleaner my husband's always looking for grill cleaners so I got this one for him so he can try it out we've never had one shape like this so I'll see if he likes that okay then the last items are all food items so and then we'll be done so I grabbed this T TGI Fridays the party bites they're Buffalo Ranch baked they looked good so I went ahead and grabbed them if I don't like them I know my son will I probably only eat a few anyway um, so grab those it's a nice size bag you get 4.1 ounces which it does say 25% more. I grabbed a small box of this uh, minute rice. I love minute rice. But I mean, I know I probably could have got a better deal, but I just went ahead and picked it up, you know, in case, you know, I just need to add a little bit more to something. Um, seven ounce box. So I still, I don't know, I think that's still pretty good for a book. I uh, picked up two packages of these 
Orchard Naturals Dice Pairs. I want to say I bought these before, but I know I've been seeing a lot of reviews that were pretty good on them. I think I have bought these before because they're in the light syrup, and I, I love to uh, grab the ones that are in the light syrup. So, yeah. So you get three, three four-ounce bowls in each package. So two of those. They finally got the brown sugar and cinnamon pop tarts in the uh, bonus pack, and these are my kids' favorite. My Dollar Tree usually always has the blueberry ones in the bonus, but they don't really care for them, so I don't pick them up. So uh, this time you get eight toaster paste pastries. Found some hungry hungry Jack family size potatoes, and actually I think I'm going to get these cooking. I'm making some barbecue baked chicken, and I think these potatoes would go well with that. So they're au gratin potatoes with a traditional savory sauce. 6.1 ounce box. So it says six servings. So for my family I'll probably have to go ahead and make both boxes to make a nice size uh, pan of those. A repurchase are these Sunkiss smoothie bars. These are delicious. Uh, you get 10 10 freezer bars in here. Uh, you just throw them in the freezer until they are frozen. You get pina colada, berry, strawberry, banana, and mango. So yep, got those again. Another repurchase for the Biscoff cookies. I mentioned these are really good. These are one of my favorite cookies. Love these. Uh, they'd be great with coffee, but you know what? Mine never make it to coffee. I usually snack on mine at night time. And then I picked up two bags of the Ocean Spray Craisins again. The blueberries. I, I preferred the blueberry infused ones more than the um, pomegranate ones. So I grabbed two more of those. I like to throw them in my salad like I said before. I like to. These are good to mix with nuts. Make your own little trail mix for a quick little snack. Um, they did have the cherry ones cherry infused ones I never did pick those up I don't think but yeah I like those I picked up two jars of the Vlasic kosher dill stackers pickles so I got these for snacks or, or sandwiches whatever um, you get 16 ounces this is a really good deal for a dollar says no artificial flavors, no colors from artificial sources, zero calories. So nice little snack. Uh, 180 milligrams of sodium. So for about two slices. Two slices is the serving size. So yep, two of those. And the last item is this candy. I got some lollipops. These are unicorn rainbow shimmer lollipops super cute and I got these actually for Happy Mail as well probably um, you get a rainbow you get the unicorn and then you get the swirly lollipops in the back so you get six in the package and then I got these tropical they are pineapple flamingo pineapple shimmer lollipops so you get the flamingo, the pineapple, and then the four swirly ones in the back. That flamingo and probably that pineapple will definitely go into some happy mail. So that is it. That I know this is a long haul. Some of you like them, some of you don't. I apologize if you don't. But if it's too long, just click out of it. Take a break, come back, and finish watching it. So. If you have not subscribed and you like these type of videos, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. And until the next one, everyone have a very blessed, blessed day. And also don't forget I have a birthday challenge giveaway going on right now. I'll link that video in the description box. But all you have to do is make me a birthday card or journaling card or send me a store-bought one 
and you'll be entered into the drawing for $47 because I turned 47 this year and if I get 10 entries at least I'll add another $10 to that and it will go into your PayPal account so I'll link that video in the description box for uh, all the information so like I said God bless bye bye